So start of this next boys game today between Broadfording and Sunrise Christian. Sunrise will be in those white uniforms going left to right. And BCA will be going right to left. So opening tip, played back to Sunrise, and they'll bring it up. Dayton Alberry will hand it off to Marco Moreau. There no there little alley-oop pass back door in the dunk oh, from boy. Dayton Alberry. That was right off the bat. Out front, Tyler Remsburg gives it up to Yaroslav Zemirov. Try to go baseline. Did Bojan Kakia? He's deflected out of bounds. Comes into Rauf Kadyrov. Kadyrov back out front. Now they swing it around to Paulius Kozlowskis. Now Zemirov again up top to Kokia. Kozlowskis, good pass underneath, but the layup missed there by Zemirov. And back the other way comes Albury for Sunrise. Down the lane, kicks it out. Moreau. And we'll swing it back around. Three ball on the wing from Brian Twang is good. Boy, nothing but that. There was Sunrise is five nothing on fire. Down the lane, that's tripped away and stolen. Back up with it comes Chuang and lost it out of bounds, but Sunrise will keep it. Sunrise will reset out front. Alberry gives it up now to Moreau. Alberry back up front, try to get a step, little crossover move, pull up jumper from 15 feet is good. Boy, that was so smooth. He had at least the, from his waist up above the nearest player. So Dayton Alberry with the bucket, Kozlowskis back the other way, he lost it. And now Sunrise to bring it up again. Twang gives it up far side to Alberry. It's like Broadfording's bringing in some more height. They do need it. No front to Alberry again down the lane. Floats, fires, that wouldn't go. Rebound underneath, put back up and in Albury. by Dayton Alberry. We also have a whistle and a foul on that play. We'll go on Kozlowskis. That's his first. And team first, it's already 9 nothing pending the free throw here as Nikita Apanasov checks into the lineup for BCA. So the free throw rattles around and off. And there's a steal. Oh, boy. And down the lane, good pass back, and the layup for Alberry. Nice body control and taking the ball and pulling in and taking it around in a circle and putting it up easily. Paulo Tino, by the way, a nice job of getting the ball, too. And there's Paul with another board. So flip it off. 5.15 to go in the first. 11 nothing is the lead for Sunrise. Pass goes in the post. Now they swing it around. Three ball in the corner. That's good. Oh, wow. Triple for Brian Twang. They just really have come out shooting the stars down. Should be 14 nothing, I do believe. Three ball on the baseline. That's good. So finally connecting on a shot for BCA is Bogdan Ivanichkin. 
So should be 14-3. Off it goes to the baseline for Moreau. Trying to swing it back up. 4.30 to go here in the first. What you're doing in Broadford and you're trying to get yourself acclimated to the kind of game you're going to have to play. On the lane, and that layup is good. Boy, Dayton Albury has He's just unstoppable. Been getting to the hoop left and right. In front, Kakia gets it back along the baseline, now fires it, and it's picked off. Out on the run, Albury leaves it off down the middle, and the layup there for Paul Otino. 18 3. 3.45 to go in the first. Down the lane. Now off into the corner. Kakia's shot wouldn't go, and now Sunrise with another board. Yeah. Paul coming down with that one again. It's number two. Alberry. Green ball on the wing. That's good. And once again, the triple for Brian Chuang. Somebody should teach him how to shoot, don't you think? It's, yeah. It's Boy, he gets getting nothing, a little ridiculous. That's nothing but that. Twice in a row from way downtown. 21 to 3. That should have been a travel over there on the far side. And that's thrown away. But we'll see. They're going to give it back to Sunrise. Polias uh, Kozlowskis back into the lineup. No. In for Sunrise is Anatoly Gunter. And the post it goes for Otino. Now three ball on the wing. That's good. Another triple from Marco Moreau. It's like they're shooting free throws from long distance. It's just boom, boom, boom. 24 to 3. We still have 2.30 to go in the first quarter. Down the lane and a whistle and a foul, although looked like he just lost the ball going up, but they'll give it to Marco Moreau, his first team first. Right, yeah, it looked like he just slipped it right out of his pocket and gone. That free throw is good. And Epanasov with the free throws there, making it 24 to 5. Down the lane, save back out to Chuang in the corner to the swing it across. On the baseline, that shot is blocked underneath by Apanasov. Yeah, Apanasov is one of the, the big guy that brought in to give a little more strength inside. That was a good, good deal. Kadyrov swings it around to Zamirov. He'll fire along too, and that's good. Yaroslav Zamirov. Tell you what, we've seen some beautiful shooting this game already, and even though the score is rather lopsided. Both teams have, have put the ball in the hoop pretty well. 24-7. Back up with it is Anatoly Gunter. He'll fire a deep three. That's way off the mark. Back out of there with it comes BCA down the lane. And that's good. Boy, that's a nice take to the rim by Yaroslav Zemirov. 24-9. Walking up into the front court, Gunter pushed it to the left side. In the post to Otino. Up top, Chuang for three. Good again. <laughs> Brian has just been ridiculously hot here early. 
27-9, the lead for Sunrise, 30-second timeout. We'll be back with more in a moment. You're watching the NCSAA. After the timeout, Bradford will bring the ball up into the front court here. And then a whistle and an illegal screen on Nikita Apanasov. That's his first team second. Hmm. Apanasov. Off on the wing, Twang for three. That's the first oh. one that he's missed, and that mm. almost went in, too. He actually missed one, and not by much. Three ball in the corner, no good by Bogdan Ivanichkin. Back the other way, Gunter will pull it back out. Mm -hmm. Oh. Kadyrov push it up to Ivanichkin. Down to six seconds to go in the quarter. Three ball at the buzzer. Won't go for Polius Kozlowskis. And at the end of one, it's a 27-9 lead for Sunrise. Come back with your second quarter in just a few minutes. You're watching the NCSA. Start of quarter number two, 27-9 is the lead for Sunrise. Three along the baseline, wouldn't go. Rebound put back up. That's blocked inside by Oteno, but that pass now picked off by Gunter. Pushes it up the far side. Oteno down the lane and to lay it in. Good take by Paul, and we've got I guess it was just an official's timeout. I guess it was just an official's timeout. So. I like to see the, the big guy running like that. He runs effectively. Tempo on the baseline. That won't go, but tip back up and in nicely oh, nice. by Paulius Kozlowskis. Seems like uh, 
Broadfooting is starting to settle down a little bit into this, to playing this tough of a team. 29-9. Spinning away is Trang down the lane. Good pass underneath. Otino wasn't ready for it, though. Good take in and a nice layup by Anatoly Gunter. <laughs> they just really are good. 31-11. Baseline with it is Zeminov. Down the lane, that shot blocked by Otino, right at the front of the rim. And back up with it comes Chuang. Good pass ahead in the two hand dunk for Dayton Albury. Oh boy. He come flying in there like a madman with both hands, double dunk. Thirty-three, eleven. Down the lane, that pass picked off by Otino. Back up with it is Gunter. Down the lane, kicks it out in the corner. Trang for three. That's no good. Down to five forty-five to go in the half. Yeah. On the songs. And now Sunrise to push it back up again. Baseline mm. three ball. That's good. Another triple for Marcelino Edwards. Well, you just, you just hard, can't hardly leave any of those guys open. You let them shoot, they'll make it. 36-11. And we have a timeout. We do. A full timeout, 5.19 to go in the half. Back with more in just a minute. You're watching the NCSAA. Out of the timeout. Another turnover here, and Sunrise will bring it up. Oh, and a little alley oop pass back door, and almost a one handed alley oop dunk by Alberry. We got a whistle and a foul on Paulius Kozlowskis, who just kind of came back and bodied him off the rim. Throw off the mark for Albury. Yeah, make one out of two. Bring it back to the middle. That's picked off. Gunter with it ahead. Another break and an alley oop pass back. I thought it might have been a little bit too hard of a pass. Yeah. But Otino caught it. He just couldn't quite get the dunk down. 
didn't hardly have enough time to get the ball in the right direction to the rim. There's a nice shot. Nikita Aparasov with the long two. Make it 37-13. Edwards with it. Marcelino swings it far side. Hunter with it. Pulls out. Fires. That's short. Under four minutes to go now in the half. And the post it goes. That pass stolen away. Alberry with it in the front court. Otino back to Alberry. He'll fire a three. That's good. Rattle it in for oh, Dayton Alberry. Just go ahead and throw it up there. They are seven of ten from three point range. <laughs> That's just ridiculous. That's better than uh, That's better than the Bulls do. In front to the far side now for Remsburg. Now to Kozlowskis. Good pass underneath. Oh, nice pass. Missing that was Tyler Rumsberg. Edwards got that rebound. Down the lane, and that layup is good. Dayton Albury with another take. Boy, the speed he has, then the... Then the flight they can get out of his legs and control the ball at the same time with his hands beautiful Kakia fires that won't go we've gone underneath to Edwards his second um, rebound out to Alberry and he'll send it back to the middle 220 to go in the half 42 13 pass in the middle is picked off now Otino with it Three ball on the wing. That rattles oh. in and out. Even when they missed it, looks like it's going in, though. Yeah, it, it just... Back the other way. Good luck. And the layup underneath by Nikita Apanasov. 42-15. This thing, broadcasting is losing 42-15. to And they would beat probably three-fourths of the teams here. Oh, yeah, this BCA team is, is not a bad basketball team, but no, you're just playing good. playing a team that's just like that, like that. hitting <laughs> everything. <laughs> Brian Train with his 4-3 of the game, and that'll make it 45-15. And they aren't doing a full-court pressing or anything like that. They're backing up and taking the defense at half, half court. Man. There's another steal. Otino down the lane and missed that dunk. I think Kakia got just enough in front of him to make him adjust the path a little bit. You can lay up underneath. We'll make it 45-17 under a minute to go in the half. Oh. Hunter hands it off. Now in the corner for Alberry. Bronson trying to go man to man. Oh. Try to go alley oop back door. That wouldn't work. And then laid up and in by Paul Otino. 47 17, down to the last 30 seconds in this half. And that's off the mark. Collected underneath by Edwards. Mm -hmm. and head to Albury. On the seven seconds. Three, two, that deflected, and that will do it for the half. 47-17 is the lead for Sunrise over Broadfording. Your first half totals first off for Broadfording. Yaroslav Zamira with four points, six for Nikita Apanasov, including two of two from the line. Tyler Remsberg has two points, one three-point field goal for Bogdan Ivanichkin, and two points for Paulius Kozlowskis, uh, Broadfording one of four from three-point range. For Sunrise, 
One three-pointer for Marcelino Edwards, two for Anatoly Gunter, one three for Marco Moreau, six points for Paul Otano, 12 for Brian Twang on four three-point field goals. 18 points for Dayton Albury, including a three, and one of three from the free throw line. Sunrise, eight of 12 from three-point range. Pass off to you for our rebounds in the first half. All right, rebounding first of all for Broadfording. We have uh, Zamu uh, Zamurev with one, uh, Aponisov with one, and Paulus Kazlowskis with three for a total of five rebounds. For Sunrise, we have uh, Dayton Albury with two, uh, Marcelino uh, Edwards with three, Anatoly Gunter with one, and Paul Tino with three for a total of nine. So a little bit of a, of a advantage, nine to five by Sunrise, but Sunrise didn't need any rebounds. They didn't miss very many shots. No, they didn't. 47-17 is the lead. We'll take a break. We'll come back with your second half here in just a little bit. You're watching the NCSAA.
So Sunrise up 57-19 at the 40-point mark. That's a running clock for the rest of the game. We're not too far from that. Skip pass through. Zemirov, that won't go. He's not collected underneath. And Sunrise will bring it up. Hunter out front. Over to Albury. Two minutes to go in this third quarter. Dayton down the lane. Alley oop back door for Paulo Tino. And there's your 40 point advantage. Jumper on the wing won't go for Zemirov. The clock should be running at this point. And for some reason, is not. Got a few subs coming in uh, for Sunrise. Gonna call off the dogs a little bit. Let Broadford have some breathing room. So, up front it comes to Kakian. Now, back near side for Kozlowskis. That's stolen away. Out in the break comes Alberry down the lane and dunks it with the right hand. Boy, just so quick with his hands. He stole that ball. Nobody knew it was gone yet. 61-19. If you're, if you're Broadfording, just run along slow pos uh, uh, possession type of offense. Go well on the baseline along two. It's off the mark for Kadyrov. And saved underneath. Into the lineup comes Hussein Torre. Now that clock is running. Down to 23 seconds. Got a whistle and a foul underneath. Nice job that time. Logan on Vonda check. Uh, got the ball inside and put her in amongst the tall timbers. Ignacio Herrero with the foul. For some reason, the clock is not running now, which it should be. It shouldn't be stopping for anything. Out front, down to six seconds. Hunter with it. Down the lane, finger rolls it. No, and that'll do it for the quarter. 61-21 is the lead for Sunrise here at the end of three. We'll be back with their fourth quarter in a moment. You're watching the NCSAA National Tournament.
Start of quarter number four, 61 21 is the lead for Sunrise. Runichkin's pass sails out of bounds. And will be Sunrise basketball. Gunter will back it out. Oh, crossover down the lane. Good handoff underneath in the layup for Ignacio Herrera. And penetrated the middle there and just dumped it off to Ignacio and he had an easy two points. Three ball out front. That won't go. Yeah, it's deflected out of bounds. Three ball on the wing is good for Nikita Apanasu. It's back up, it comes into the front court. And that's Holy Gunter, it kicks it off along the baseline. Now, out of there with it comes Kadyrov, pushes it ahead. That layup misses, and we got a whistle. And. What just happened there? Subs, maybe? Not real sure. 63-26. Well, 22 just got a rebound for one thing, and there's no 22 in the book. Well, he's not up here. Under six minutes to go. That's stolen away. And that layup is good, and there's... Yeah, there is. You're talking about this guy right here? For no, on, on them. Oh, okay. Uh, timeout on the floor. 5.48 to go in this one. 63.28. Take a break. Back with more in just a moment. You're watching the NCSAA. So out of the timeout, Sunrise brings it up. Gunter down the lane, gets free, and lays it in with the left hand. Good take by Anatoly. 65-28, down to five and a half to go here in the game. Yeah. Keep your off out front to Ivanichkin. Samirov. Swings it back up top to Apanasov. I'm broad fronting. I don't get in any hurry at all. I was on Hussein Torre, his first. Team first. On the lane, that ball thrown away. Jumper from the wing banks in. So, Samira well, with the bucket. An interesting jump shot from the left hand side out there quite a ways. Yeah, we got a whistle and a travel. It did look kind of cumbersome. I don't know. Traveling was a good call of any. Yeah. Hey, the bench over there. 
Defense for Hey, why Sunshine. not? Sunrise. Underneath, that wouldn't go. Pick back up along the near side. Speaking of people who aren't in a book, and little tip back up underneath by Zimurov is good. 65-32. Runner in the middle of the lane is good for Anatoly Gunter. 67-32, 3.45 to go. Gonna work along the baseline of kick it back up top for again Calvis out front three ball wouldn't go by Zemurev and back up with it comes Sunrise Gunter with his second rebound three ball in the corner good <laughs> triple by number 22. Nice smooth shot. I don't know what his name is, but boy, he can sure hit a shot. Try to work down the lane. That runner's no good. Tip back up, no. Slap back out. Taken down by Kadyrov. On the 245 to go here. Three ball on the wing. That's no good. Collected down, and now Sunrise will bring it back up. Three ball out front, no good from Gunter. And we got a whistle and a timeout. Mike saying it's just a substitution timeout here to get everybody in. Just about the end of this, aren't we? The end of the Down to uh, two, minutes two minutes to go here in the fourth quarter. 70-32. Ramsburg trying to go inside and then threw it away. Yeah, he was trying to hit the Ponosov underneath there. And it comes. That's deflected. Now stolen away by Kadyrov. On the lane, on the run. Wow, that's a nice oh. little flip up by Imanichkin. Boy, that was, oh, he just caught the and pass. And gets the steal and then gets fouled on the head of the free throw line. So the foul on Ignacio Herrera. Well, you had a burst of a, several things right in a row there. So to the free throw line goes... Poked on Ivanichkin, and the first free throw is good. 70-34 as the clock continues to run, down to 110 left. Mm -hmm. oh, nice, nice free throw shooting. Boy, he had a profitable trip down the court at that time. 70-36. Gunter trying to get a step in the lane. Out front, three ball. That's short. Rebound saved underneath. And back up comes BCA on the run. On the baseline. Jumper there is no good. Gunter's fourth rebound. Gunter kicks it off in the corner. Three ball. That will go from Torre. Rebound put back up and in on the inside. Down to the final 20 seconds. I think BCA has had enough. I think so. We'll dribble out the last 10 seconds and that'll do it. I mean, actually, they didn't play bad. They yeah, that's too bad, all things considered. 72-36 is going to be the final as Sunrise wins it. Your final totals, first off for Broadfording, Yaroslav Zemirov with 10 points, Nikita Apanasov, with nine points, including a three and two of two from the line. Tyler Rumsberg with two points. Paulius Kozlowskis with two points. 
13 for Bogdan Ivanichkin, including a 3 and 2 of 3 from the line. Uh, Broadfording is 2 of 8 from 3-point range. For Sunrise, Marcelino Edwards with one 3-point field goal. 6 points for Anatoly Gunter. 9 for Marco Moreau. 12 points for Brian Chang, including 4 3-point field goals. 10 for Paulo Tino. 2 for Ignacio Herrera. Uh, oh. Number uh, 22, who wasn't in the book, ended up with five points, including a three. 22 points for Dayton Alberry, and including a three and one of three from the free throw line. Sunrise, nine of 18 from three point range. And I'll pass it up to you for our rebounds. All right, first of all, for Broadfording, we had uh, Ralph Kadyrov with one, uh, Yaroslav. Sam Muniv with four. Bojan Kakia with one. Nikita Aponisov with one. And Noah Goncalves with one. And Paulus Aslaskis with six for a total of 14. 14 for broadca broadcasting for Sunrise. We had Dayton Albury with three. Marcelino Edwards with three. Anatoly Gunter with four. Uh, Marco Moreau with three, Brian Chang with one, and Paul Otino with six, along with Ignacio Herrera, one, for a total of 21. So uh, Sunrise did control the rebounding as well, 21 to 14. And Sunrise wins it, 72-36. One more game to come your way yet tonight. It will be a girls' matchup between Gateway Legacy and Portersville. That's scheduled to begin in about a half hour from now. You've been watching the NCSAA National Tournament. 